if you have to give advice to a young person final we have already talked about this but let's just one liner i would say a young person around young person. 25 to 28 some 25 to 30 person give me my book okay yeah i want to talk anyways about this why ah, so so, uh, so I, here here with what i say right yeah. everybody likes retire age look at this yeah. i'm saying invest rupees 40 a day yeah. so a kid who is 21 22 mm. starts putting away 40 rupees a day which mm. technically means about 1200 to 1300 uh, yeah. month yeah. and if he gets 17% which index has given so far he mm. still collect something like 3 or 4 crores yeah. but then is 60 now you take a step back and you say if he were to do this as a step up sip mm. which means it increases by 10% mm. he will not have just 4.4 crores he will have 13 mm. crores yeah. so the challenge is to tell a 22 year old start putting 40 rupees a day because mm. if you tell him put 15000 rupees he'll say go take a walk mm. i got other priorities mm. but when you tell him 50 rupees a day mm. for uh, 1500 a month it will take care of your retirement he say hey this looks good yeah. this is possible mm. so when he is that young yeah. he can do that if he is even younger let's say if he is 17 18 you tell the father to put 500 rupees because 17 18 is not a donor he is just yeah. in 12th standard ask the father to put 500 a month so that you know by the time he is 24 and he finishes his education i'm assuming he does an M- mba also so he's 24 he'll have some corpus yeah. and by the time he is 27 he may have 10 12 lakhs yeah. so he will feel confident, confident that ha huh, i have some corpus and then you have to this, teach the kid do yeah. not touch it yeah i think because it, this is your retirement if a person does this much with the kid financial literacy is done done he will understand he will understand that if i have a mango tree yeah i will keep getting mangoes correct okay. as long as i don't cut the tree correct okay. This has happened with all the big families of in India. Right? I mean, when, when I talk about billas, when I talk about when people talk about billas, they have so much money. Uh-huh. It is 168 years of compounding. Okay. Yeah. It is. <laughs> they started like we do for our. Uh, yeah, right? yeah. So if you have a kid who is say under five, hmm. and if you do a 25,000 rupee SIP for the next say 20 years and leave it as it is, hmm. and then the kid puts 5,000 or 10,000 or 20,000, the kid will have thousand crores at 65. But the most important thing is to teach the kid do not touch. Yeah, correct. So I am creating so other corpus for you to buy a house, buy yeah. a car, go on a honeymoon. Yeah, don't touch this. Correct. So what? I'll just summarize this. So what you are saying is a young person does not need to do much. All he has to do is put some money. All he has to do is do. All he has to do is put a small amount of money and Absolutely. don't touch it. Don't, don't worry it. about ups and downs and don't worry about mid cap, large cap, small cap, a multi cap fund. in which he puts 500 a month or say 1500 a month mm. with a 10% jump every year increase it as your salary is 10% Because yeah. see, because you are starting with a such a small amount, a ten percent increase doesn't mean yes. much. Yes. If you are starting with one lakh, then a ten percent increase can and mean more. Yeah, yeah. So don't have to worry. Yes. And anyways, the big additions will happen towards the end. Correct. And you'll have a job, you'll have a PF, you'll have all that. But you know that this corpus, which your father started for you and yeah. you started, yeah. somewhere at fifty-two, yeah. you can tell your boss, "Kal se nahi aata." <laughs> that is <laughs> financial independence. Correct. Correct. And uh, the second point, more important, I would say, is what will you tell to people who are now somewhere in their fifty, forty-five to fifty, who are kind of scared? कि भाई कुछ किया नहीं, अभी आज तक कुछ इतना कमाया लेकिन वो किधर गया? Now they are very worried because you know even when we we also do a lot of workshops in different cities, couples come to the workshop in their forty-five, fifties, they are very very scared. कि यार ये आप बोल रहे हो बीस साल तीस साल में वेल्थ होगा हमारे पास तो दस साल ही बचा है अभी क्या करने का दे गेट वेरी वेरी टेंस्ड सो आई टेल दम कि यार सिक्सटी पे यू डोंट वरी यू कैन गो टिल सेवेंटी यू हैव दैट ट्वेंटी थर्टी इयर्स क्रिएट क्रिएट अ जॉब लुक फॉर अ जॉब इन अ कंपनी विच इज यू नो Uh, not professionally managed, family managed. They don't have such strict rules on retirement. Mm. You may be, yeah. they may allow you to work till your sixty-five, sixty-six, as long as your body allows you to. Yes. So that is one possibility. Scale down your standard of living now. Yeah. Don't still insist that you want a foreign vacation and things like that. You can't afford it. You can't afford yeah. it. Get realistic. Yes. Because I said, like corpus is in, multiplied by thirty. Mm. Your expenses at sixty multiplied by thirty. Mm. So if if you can reduce that expenses. By one rupee, you're reducing your requirement of corpus by thirty rupees. Hmm. So if you can simplify your living as much as possible, yeah. then use a car for thirteen years instead hmm. of using it for eight. Hmm. Right? If you need a car at all, 
Uh, you don't need a three BHK. You can shift to one BHK. You are mm. you creating more space for yourself. Or yeah. Don't over support your kids. Yeah. Right. Those are the places where you lose cash. Don't say my kid wants to do business, so I'm giving it out of my corpus. Don't do such stupid things. Yeah. Just take care, keep a simple lifestyle, and then shift to a cheapest possible place within what you like. Okay. You can't shift to some place which you don't like. So okay. shift to a cheap place and try doing, try walking around and using, try using public transport. All these yeah. things dramatically bring down your. So, so what you're saying is yes, the time has gone. It was bad, but still you can do a lot of things if you have the willpower and you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Postpone the retirement by ten years, and you will not commit suicide because you don't have money. You will struggle a bit. Some son might help, neighbor might help, nephew might help. Something might happen. Like if my neighbor doesn't have uh, ability to go to the hospital, I take him in my car. So that's that's what happens.